Hi, this is Paul from Wave5Trade.com and this is my daily stock signals video for Wednesday the 19th of September. Had a couple of days off on the videos as I was training with my inner circle, but I'm back now getting these daily videos out. Uh, so we're going to look at just one of our signals from the hundreds that our members get every day. In the members area, our members get to download spreadsheets every single day for potential long and short fifth wave trades on the 60 minute, the daily and the weekly time frame. These are potential fifth wave moves, and which is the highest probability move in an alley wave sequence and therefore a trend. And also we have some bonus stochastic long and stochastic short trading signals as well. I'm going to look at longs today with the longs. Our members simply click on the image uh, in today's section and download the spreadsheet. The spreadsheet looks like something like this today. And we're looking, I'm going to look at the daily time frame today, a bit of a swing trade. NTRA, right at the bottom there, Matera Inc. on the daily time frame. So let's have a look at that on the chart. So <clears throat> this is our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the NinjaTrader NT8 platform. It's also available for TradeStation, MultiCharts and the TOS thing called Swim. But I'm going to use the NinjaTrader as an example today. We have the lows all the way down here around about the 4th of the 4th, 2018. Uh, I've got isolated the lows down there for those that have got the Elliott Wave Indicator Suite. Then it's given us a small bullish uh, move and then a very sort of sideways action just here. And then our Indicator Suite is automatically labeled the 1, the 2, the 3 and the 4 on this, um, put on this bullish move so far. What we're really interested in is how that Wave 4 behaves. And we've got some things to measure that and also which forms part of our signal service so the first filter is we've had a wave four pullback so we've had some profit taking against that main bullish trend we've found support in our automated probability zones these are our pullback zones we find support in the green zone there's an 85 percent probability if it goes on and moves away from that wave four we're going to get hit, hit our automated target zone up, up here in blue ran about $32 at the top end of that target zone there. So an 85% probability we're going to go on and make that new wave five high. Also, the behavior of this wave four is important. And on our 535 oscillator here, we have the pullback between 90 and 140%, which is great. The stochastic you see on the yellow dots on the top, on the on the left there on the bottom subchart, we have those yellow dots. These denote a really strong bullish trend. They have stopped, but then we've pulled back against that strong bullish trend and crossed over in the oversold zone. The likelihood is it wants to go back to that main bullish trend. So there's a three main filters that we look at. Setting this up is very, very simple. We are looking to swing trade that fifth wave move. This is a daily time frame for NTRA, remember? And we've already found the support. We had a really great rejection of those lows at the wave four. We have gapped down a little bit there, but yesterday we consolidated with a positive day. So as long as this holds and we start to move up, this should be a really good looking trade. So for today's bar position, the entry 2623 gets us out of a 6-4 moving average high, the green moving average here. This is part of our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite. And this is our conservative entry strategy. So we want to be above there for today's um, bar position. And we're also just above this little pivot point on the Wave 3 as well. Just a bit of resistance there. So 2623 is the entry long for NTRA on the daily time frame. The stop loss is just below the Wave 4 low here on this rejection. And that's around about 22.88. That gives us a risk to reward of 1 to 1.6 into the middle of our target zone there. We're talking maybe $32 into here. So really good looking trade. A traditional swing trade off a daily time frame can take anything up to 11, maybe 25 days at the moment. Sometimes it's going a little longer because they are quite complex in their moves. And a lot of stocks obviously will be... Um, reacting to market sentiment very closely at the moment with tariff news and all that sort of thing. So, you know, not they're not normal with fifth waves at the moment. Some of them might even reach three days. We've recently had a short on Twitter that reached the target in three days. 
but traditionally you're looking for about 11 days maybe 20 uh, and maybe a little bit longer but in reality what we're looking for is a $32 target we're looking to go long when it goes through 2623 so that's it for today very simple swing trade for the fifth wave move on NTRA on the daily time frame the original signals came from our stock scanner membership and then I've just used the Ninja Trader NTA Elliott Wave Indicator Suite from wave5trade.com um, uh, to set this, this up. Remember, it's also available for TradeStation, Think or Swim and Multicharts. Okay, that's it for today. Have a great trading day. Speak to you all tomorrow.